vacation, suits them. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry were spotted holding hands while enjoying a romantic getaway on a luxurious Caribbean island after traveling to New York City for World Mental Health Day. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex were seen looking loved up as ever as they strolled the streets on the island of Canoan in St. Vincent and the Grenadines on Friday, according to a photo obtained by the Daily Mail. They just looked very happy to be having a holiday together, an insider told the outlet. Harry was in full vacation mode as he rocked shorts, a t-shirt, flip-flops and a baseball cap. Meanwhile, Markle looked chic in a long white-knit maxi dress, sunglasses and a white sun hat adorned with a black ribbon. The source shared that the couple was seen exiting a gourmet food store in the Sandy Lane Yacht Club and Marina in Glossy Bay looking affectionate and filled with laughter. As Harry walked out of the shop, he slightly bumped into one of the barrels, outside, and they both giggled and Meghan reached for his hand, the insider said. The world-class marina is known for its luxurious accommodations waterside dining options and rejuvenating leisure facilities, according to its website. It's unclear if the red-headed royal and his wife were staying in one of the Lux Marina suites or villas, which range in price from $600 to $3,000 per night depending on the layout. The pair enjoyed their lavish trip without their two kids, Prince Archie, four, and Princess Lilibet, two, on Monday, the Sussexes reportedly flew back to the United States on a private jet, landing in Atlanta, looking refreshed and relaxed. Prior to their mini getaway, Harry, 39, and Markle, 42, dropped by the Big Apple to discuss mental health. During their Archwell Foundation Parent Summit, titled Mental Wellness in a Digital Age, Harry and Markle chatted with moderator Carson Daly on the detrimental effects of cyberbullying. Being a mom is the most important thing in my entire life, outside, of course, being a wife to this one, the suits, Alum said, gesturing to Harry. But I will say I feel fortunate that our children are at an age, again quite young, so this isn't in our immediate future, but I also feel frightened at how it's continuing to change and this will be in front of us, she added. Markle has been quite busy building their Hollywood empire. Right before making her way to Manhattan, she stopped by the Beverly Hills Oat for a business lunch. Last month, she was by Harry's side during his 2023 Invictus Games in Germany and the couple also attended Kevin Costner's charity fundraiser at his Santa Barbara, California, estate. Markle's comeback will reportedly be rooted in giving back and she plans on using her platform for philanthropy.